Tetracyclines are a class of broad-spectrum antibiotics. In this mnemonic video, we will teach you an easy way to remember everything you need to know about tetracyclines for the NCLEX. Let's get started. Today we're visiting this little boy's driveway, where he is learning how to ride a bicycle. This red, shiny bicycle is our symbol for the drug class tetracyclines. Because tetracycline and bicycle both have cycle in them. Get it? Plus, this boy's bicycle still has training wheels attached to it. So these four wheels can help you remember that we're talking about tetracyclines. Because tetra means four. Tetracyclines are easy to recognize because they end with cycline. Some common tetracyclines you might see on test day include doxycycline or minocycline. Just remember this bicycle when you see a drug ending in cycline. This little guy has been outside riding his bicycle all day, and now his mom is calling him in for dinner. He'll definitely need to use that hand sanitizer she's holding. You know how kids get when they've been outside all day? Dirty. Plus, who knows how many times this guy has fallen while learning how to ride his bicycle? Yeah, hand sanitizer is definitely a must here. By the way, here at Pixarize, we use hand sanitizer to symbolize antibiotics because they are both used to kill bacteria. Tetracyclines are a broad-spectrum antibiotic, meaning they can treat a really wide variety of bacterial infections. Just remember this bottle of hand sanitizer to remember that tetracyclines kill bacteria, not viruses or fungi. Next. Let's talk about some side effects of tetracyclines. This boy has a really bad sunburn from being outside riding his bicycle all day, especially in a hot, sunny desert like this. You can use this boy's sunburn to help you remember that tetracyclines cause photosensitivity. In other words, it makes the skin more sensitive to the sun, so people taking tetracyclines are more likely to get sunburns. Educate your patients to wear sunblock and protective clothing when outdoors, and if possible, to avoid direct sunlight. Uh-oh, this boy has taken another tumble, causing him to face plant into the dirt. Dirt has gotten all over, including in his teeth. This boy's dirty teeth are here to symbolize tooth discoloration. If tetracyclines are given to children, it can cause permanent discoloration of their teeth usually a gray or brown color. For this reason, it is best to avoid tetracyclines in children. This tooth discoloration can even happen to a fetus if a pregnant woman takes tetracyclines during the third trimester. We'll talk more about pregnancy later, but for now, just remember the dirty teeth for tooth discoloration. This boy's mom is all ready for dinner. If only her boy would just wash up and come inside. She is holding a glass of milk to try and convince him to come in, but it doesn't look like it's working. This glass of milk is our symbol for, well, milk. Just like this boy is saying no to the milk, patients taking tetracyclines should avoid milk and other high calcium foods. The mom also has a bottle of Tums tucked under her arm, prepared for any indigestion after dinner. But once again, the boy is saying no. Use this bottle of Tums to symbolize antacids, since Tums are a popular brand of antacids, right? And like before, patients taking tetracyclines should avoid taking antacids. Both calcium and antacids can bind with the tetracycline drug and prevent its absorption in the body. So best to stay away. Last but not least, take a look at that tarantula there on the boy's bicycle tire. The big tarantula scared the boy, and that's what caused him to fall off the bicycle into the dirt. I can't blame him. That tarantula does look scary. Here at Pixarize, we use a tarantula to symbolize that a drug is teratogenic, or toxic to the fetus. We mentioned earlier that it can cause tooth discoloration in the fetus, but more than that, it can also impair bone mineralization. Because of this, Tetracyclines should not be given to pregnant women. 
All right, that's everything for tetracyclines. Let's quickly summarize. Tetracyclines are easy to recognize because they end in cycline, like doxycycline or minocycline. Tetracyclines are a broad spectrum of antibiotics and can treat a wide variety of bacterial infections. Tetracyclines can cause photosensitivity, so patients should be advised to wear sunblock and avoid direct sunlight. Tetracyclines can also cause tooth discoloration in young children. Tetracyclines should not be taken with milk or antacids as they prevent drug absorption. And finally, tetracyclines are teratogenic and should not be given to pregnant women. Thanks for joining me in this mnemonic video. I'll catch you in the next. Thanks for watching. For more videos like this one, subscribe to our channel and check out our newest lessons. For more resources on this topic, including fact lists and interactive review images, click the image next to the More Here arrow. I'll see you next time.